Welcome to our office, Mexico Tourist Board. Here is a part of our essential of Mexico. I would like to show you the beauty of the handicrafts of Mexico. Here are some spices from Mexico, like the chocolate, the chile, the achote. The chocolate is uh, the, um, used to be the, the cacao, the coin of the Aztec. So who drink chocolate was just special people. Chocolate with chile, they make like a, a, a beverage, chocolate with chile. And they use it for the kings and also for those who has like the spirit with gods, like uh, we call it sacerdotes. After the Spanish people came to Mexico, it shows to the world the chocolate, that in some areas in Europe, they believe that it was too much energy and something was wrong with the, the ingredient. But at the end, they love it. The chocolate is magic. Can I get it? Yup, of course you can get it, please. This is the Katrina, one of the symbols of Mexico of the date of death. The death of date is one of the greatest festivities in the whole country. Indians always believe after death there is a life. The festivities start the 1st of November. Those people who are already dead come over the night and stay with the, the people who are living. In the map it shows the whole country and here it shows you how the land is. Forests in the south, uh, down to the Tropic of the Cancer and up down, up, uh, up on the north, there is a desert, in some areas of desert. You can see here, you know, like the desert by the ocean is amazing areas. All these places are beaches all around, are more uh, over 450 amazing beaches in Mexico. In this area of Oaxaca is where you can uh, uh, surfing, the waves are very high. And here is the Caribbean Sea in this area of the peninsula of Yucatan, where is the second reef more, uh, biggest in the world. This scarf is from uh, uh, a Mexican style. It's uh, the butterfly of uh, um, La Mariposa Monarca. This is uh, a symbol of Mexico. The butterfly flies from Canada to Mexico to reproduce in Michoacán, the state where is the copper mines. And, um, uh, is uh, this the, the original color of the butterfly and it's amazing to see the forest planting of butterflies on the trees. Uh, that's why I'm wearing because I like to wear the part of my country always. One of the point of view of the four rangers about Mexico is that the coastline of both sides of the country by the east side is the Atlantic, the Gulf of Mexico, and by the Pacific uh, uh, Ocean in the wet sides is uh, these amazing beaches uh, that uh, refresh the visitor. In the southeast there is the Caribbean Sea, but besides the beaches also uh, we have the archaeologic zones and uh, the culture of the Mexican empires and the gastronomic. Also, there's uh, a lot of activities, uh, sport activities that now are discovered in Mexico that is uh, uh, one of the, the, the best activities to do. Maybe flying in the cave of the Golondrinas uh, or uh, 
um, scuba diving by the El Cenotes. We are thinking that now we have to develop uh, the mice, tourists and the weddings we have to develop more in this region of the uh, in my, my um, region that I, are, I work for that are the CIS countries and also the Baltic region and we are trying to develop those issues the mice, tourists, the weddings and also the healthy Last year, more than 32,000 tourist visitors of Russia, and in total in my region, it was more than 65. We keep in Mexico on the mind of the Russian people by providing information to our tour operators about all the destinations of Mexico. We have a program of webinars that we can cover 10 uh, countries in this uh, region. Well, it, it can be, and it is, uh, a very good uh, platform what you offer because it's how we can interact with uh, visitors and, uh, you know, the main um, uh, importance in Mexico is uh, that the, the tourists from Russia go there, but also their opinion to uh, reconstruction, uh, rebuild our service and also to come back. We work for uh, visitors to come back to our country, not just to go once. And we appreciate the comments that they left in this platform because that will improve our service in Mexico for all of us who work for the tourist industry. Well, I will tell them that please welcome to Mexico. There's a nice country and you will love the experience of Mexico. You will enjoy it.